Hey, it's Ryan, Chris, Tony from Shootwise. Today we got a three gun video. We're going to talk about some midgets. The midget. And of course we, we make these hand guards out of regular carbine like ones. So my setup is a traditional uh, tactical. You have a... American traditional tactical. American traditional tactical. Butterfly. Wow. Look like a motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold up. We got some midgets here. They're all based on uh, Rock River 9mm lowers and uppers. So, uh, Ryan, you were the first one to build. Why don't you talk about yours? Well, first I bought the uh, Rock River as an SBR. It was just a traditional tactical looking one. And I was like, man, you know what? It would be pretty cool as a retro A2 looking one. Maybe with a little bit of a shorter stock. LWRC makes a shorter buffer tube compared to a traditional mil spec. Original midget. I've had several people uh, ask me to build one of these for them. So there's several on the market out there. I did the uh, MP3 coating from Robar on the bulk carrier group. Also, I prefer the uh, the Star Selector from Rock River. Let's check out this bolt carrier group. Look how slick that is. All this carbon buildup, you just wipe it right off. No solvent needed. Also, self lubricates, so you don't have to worry about lubricating your weapon. The midget. After seeing Ryan's retro build, I decided that I had to have one too. Uh, I decided to go a little lighter and just do a uh, pistol instead of an SBR, uh, which I probably am going to SBR this pretty soon because uh, I like his stock on his. Uh, but I decided to go a little light just to make it more easily transferable in case I didn't like it or wanted to sell it down the road. Uh, so I put my tax stamp money into a law tactical folder. Uh, I had to modify the bolt weight a little bit to get it, get that extra piece to fit. And it's kind of cool. Uh, I don't know. It makes it a little smaller. It's kind of neat. It'll probably end up coming off uh, once it's an SBR. Got the Magpul K grip. Uh, just regular kind of standard internals. And that's about it. Got a, a funny charging handle. I mean, it's pretty bare bones. Pretty cool process to build them. Uh, so I just I drilled and tapped the bottom of my front sight block to set it in place. It's got an old triangle end cap, and of course we we make these hand guards out of regular carbine link ones. Traditional. Tactical. You do have a American traditional tactical. American traditional tactical. You do have an octane suppressor on mine. Um, it is a little bit heavy, so it will be going to die pretty soon. I have the Tacon three more trigger in it. Three modes select. So you have your safe, fire, and third mode. For mine, I went with Magpul. Got the K2 grips on it. The CTR stock. That's the Meprolite M21. I'm going to change out the front foregrip. This one's made by Spikes. Um, I just want to put uh, a lighter weight foregrip on it. It is a little bit heavy with uh, the accessories that I have. And bus backup sights. But overall, I really like the gun. It's really fun to shoot. Yeah, we got the sights are regulated for 200 meters. So we're going to go out and see what we can do.
couple of quick doubles there. Go, what direction hit. are we going? Where are we taking this? <laughs> yeah, I was just talking about uh, dragonflies. Butterfly. Whoa. Wow. All right, so those are our midgets. This is our first three gun of maybe more, or maybe this might be the last three gun video we do. We don't know. We probably do like I don't know three ish, three or four at this point. We'll we'll see. Yeah, we we'll we see have a if lot people of even guns. watch this video. True that. Uh, some videos that we think are cool, unfortunately, others don't watch. Some stupid videos we put together all of a sudden get a lot of views. So that's all we got for our midgets. Y'all got anything to say about y'all? Yep, it's they're fun. Fun to build, fun to shoot. Alright. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, subscribe to us on YouTube. We out. Yep, thanks for watching. Shit, I don't know why I always do this. We good. Fuck your editing.